welcome once again. We are now continuing with the oil drop experiment and in this case I just want us to see an example and how we can calculate the thickness of one molecule, one molecule of oil. So we are going to read out the question which says an experiment to determine the diameter of the diameter of a molecule an oil an oil drop of diameter an oil drop of radius sorry radius spread to a patch of diameter Patch of diameter 21 centimeters. 21 centimeters. Determine the diameter of the oil molecule. Determine the diameter of the oil molecule. And part B. State any two assumptions. Made any two assumptions. Assumptions made any two assumptions made. And part C state the roles of lycopodium powder in the oil drop experiment. State the role of lycopodium powder in the oil drop in the oil drop experiment solution part A we are given an oil drop of radius 0 0.28 millimeters which spreads into a circular patch of diameter 21 centimeters formally we had said that this oil drop which is spherical the oil drop, which is spherical, is the one which spreads into a circular patch which has a full image of a cylinder. Because the circular patch and it has some thickness. It has some thickness. So this is cylindrical, only that it has spread very much further. The thickness is too small for one molecule thick. Therefore, we are going to relate the two volumes such that the volume of the, the drop which is spherical, is equal to the volume of the patch, which is cylindrical. Therefore, here we will say 4 out of 3 pi r cubed, which is volume of a sphere, equals to 2 pi r squared, okay? Pi r squared, which is the cross-section area times height or thickness, times thickness or diameter of the oil molecule one oil molecule you can use b for diameter for the oil molecule therefore the oil drop is having a radius of 0 0.28 so we can use millimeters in all the cases so that here we may use 210 as diameter therefore here we can say 4 out of 3 pi the radius is 0 0.28 cubed equals to 0 0.28 cubed equals to the other side pi the radius will be diameter of 210 millimeters 210 millimeters divided by 2 which is 105 millimeters squared times the diameter of the molecule which we don't know therefore here pi can cancel because it is appearing in both cases I can cancel like that Therefore, to remain with D, to remain with D on one side, to remain with D on one side, to remain with D, we can divide 4 over 3 times 0 0.28 cubed, 0 0.28 cubed, and we divide it with 105 squared 105 squared 
and this B is coming to 2.6548 times 10 raised to negative 6 millimeters. Therefore, the diameter of one molecule, the diameter of one molecule in that experiment is 2.6548 times 10 to the power of negative 6 millimeters. We can get to part B, whereby we are taught to state any two assumptions made in the experiment. And one of the assumptions is that the drop of oil is perfectly a sphere. That is, when it, before landing on the lycopodium powder to spread, it was perfectly a sphere. That is the first assumption. The second assumption is that the oil patch which is formed is perfectly cylindrical. Because we are saying it forms a circular patch which has a thickness which at, uh, as a thickness as a thickness of one molecule thickness one molecule thickness therefore it is cylindrical so we have a patch which is cylindrical and another assumption in the experiment is that the thickness of this patch formed is one molecule so the patch formed as one molecule thickness then finally we are stating the role of lycopodium like powder in the oil drop experiment. As we had mentioned earlier, the role of lycopodium powder is one, to measure the extent of spreading of the oil drop. Because once oil drop is spread, we can only examine how the lycopodium powder is, de is being displaced. And by such, we can know uh, the area into which the oil has spread to. Then again, it also breaks the surface tension of the oil so that the oil can spread until it is one molecule thick. Therefore, again, in the assumptions, we assume when the oil is spreading, it cannot spread beyond one molecule thickness. So a molecule cannot break to continue spreading. It only spreads until there is no molecule which is above another. So that is all about the oil drop experiments. I thank you for following kindly, invite a friend to this channel, tap the subscribe button and share our link. Thank you.